a quick video of the Elantra. I was been working on it later on today. As you guys can see, the windows are clear, coastal clear. Um, I did clean up the door panels, back seat. I finally got a battery in this car, which uh, came out of the GMC Sierra I have, and it fits just fine. Um, carpets look cleaner because I scrubbed it, so it does look more cleaner and it doesn't stink like shit in here like it used to. Um, I did clean up the stains out of the out of the seat, as you guys can see. These are some of the the stains that I had a hard time. But mostly, I was having a hard time with these stains. But that's not gonna bug me too much. Um, I clean up the headliner. So yeah, this car is just looking more better than it did before. Just needs a paint job, that's all. Power everything. I'm just like, legitly power everything. And this thing also has the indicator when you have the doors open. When you uh, close the door, it stops. And these Elantras, these Hyundais sure have a lot of features even if the trunk is open there's a little light that shows up about that well i have to get something out of the trunk anyways but yeah the dash is in better shape i soaked it with armor all then i put an air freshener in this the windows look very coastal clear actually but yeah everything looks really badass but let me give it a start up here. Starts up like a charm. It's already 6.17 p.m. already. Headlights work. All the lights work. Everything works. Very bitchin' and badass. It's very quiet. You can't even tell if the engine's running. Surprisingly, everything still works. Even uh, the light for the trunk still works. Even if it is a Hyundai Elantra GLS. Very quiet exhaust system. Still need to take care of that expired registration from the DMV. I have to raise hell at him again. DMV? More like dick my virgin. Um, let me turn off the headlights here to help save power. Um, there is a bit of a rattle coming out of the glove box. I don't know why, but yeah, let me go over the features here. This thing has power door locks. As you guys can see, it unlocks the other doors, which that's really cool. Um, it is low on gas. I have to get gas for this soon. Uh, air conditioning works. It has cruise control, rear defrost, and hazards light. Um, yeah. Radio still doesn't work. Which, I'm going to change that with a stock stereo, because that sounds pretty fine to me. Um, yeah. It's pretty the same as before, but it just looks more cleaner. Uh, not just like that, if I turn on the lights, it has a light in there, and a light in the glove box. Um, yeah. It just looks so much more better than as before. Um, hopefully I can get a dashboard cover for these things, or I think I don't really need one. But yeah, let me just turn this thing off here. But before turning it off, maybe... Now nah, I can just turn it off. But the power steering works. The car shudders a bit. I don't know why, but it just does. But yeah, it runs good. It runs really good. Dome light works. I managed to 
clean up the lens for these dome lights so it'll be actually functional. Let me show you guys under the hood. Very in good shape. Under the hood, still look the same. I just clean up all the cobwebs that the thing had gathering. Um, the brake master cylinder leaks a bit, I think. Because uh, it the, the level goes down very slowly. The power steering is still leaking. But yeah, it just looks more better. I also set the wipers back to factory because the, the way how my brother put it on there wasn't right. So, yeah. Really in good shape. I also polished up the lens because they look pretty faded. It's just cosmetic work that the car needs. It's just really, really faded pretty badly. That's more like clear coat coming off. That's primer. The bare plastic is like showing through the paint. The first accident the car was been to. But yeah. The thing is no longer a thrasher. It's going to be a perfect personal use. So yeah. But yeah. This side's pretty good. But it's just for this side. The flasher is loose. Um, this mirror would not fold. The other side does fold. You guys can see foldable mirrors. That's pretty cool. It's kind of cool that I got a very expensive luxury sedan. It's uh, everything is functional. But I'm gonna be shopping at the junkyard tomorrow and get more parts. And also that, after that, I'll take it to Morse High School, which is in the, in the other side of Bell Middle School, so it can get painted. But I'm not going to paint it um, this way how Hyundai painted from Korea, how they did it. I hate the way how they used clear coat back in the days. Well, I'm not going to use clear coat. I'm going to use step two paint like the, the Geo has. As you guys can see, it has step two paint where it does not fade at all, except for it chips. But yeah, that's that's called step two paint. This is just paint with clear coat painted over it. But I, I'm going to use the same paint that they use on the Geos. So yeah, that's going to be more better. And it's oil based paint, so or liquid, or uh, I don't know. I, I'm not really a, a paint guy, so. Yeah, hope you guys like this video, and this car will look very perfect for the channel. And yes, I will make a story edited video about this Lantra. It's going to be about how the, the beginning and what's the before and after. I will make those part two videos. I mean, not part two, uh, edited videos before and after. So, yeah, hope you guys like this video, and... Give it a thumbs up and subscribe.